Let me make sure that you can see me. Good thing I checked. Oh wait, did I go the wrong way? I for sure did. Good thing I checked again. Hi, welcome back to my kitchen. I was on YouTube as I always am and then saw Julian posted a video of him making pretzels. His were vegan, I don't wanna make vegan bite-sized pretzels, so we're gonna use butter and cheese and normal shit. It just sounds really good. And once something sounds good, I kind of have this horrible need to do it, and until I do it, I feel like I'm gonna die. So that's where we're at. Um, I took a shower. Yeah! Are you proud of me? You should be. You should be. So, preheat your oven to 450, and then if you have instant yeast, which I do, I don't have active yeast. If I did, it would be different. I'll link the original recipe that I am following in the description. If you're using instant yeast, you just throw it in with all your dry ingredients. You don't need to put it in water or anything. That's really the only difference. So, that's it. Let's get cooking good looking. <laughs> I've never said that in my life, All right? Oh wait, let me do a sick transition. Oh shit, bet you didn't expect it to open up on this. Mainly this. But listen, we worked out today, we haven't eaten, so, you know, <laughs> I guess uh, I probably should eat first now that I think about it, but I'm not going to. Make myself a drink and then we can start making pretzels. Sorry, thanks more. Watch me just turn into an ASMR channel unironically. Oh my gosh. Not ASMR, not ASMR. All right, we're done with this. Sorry, I'll get back to you. All right, and then we're just gonna get our shot glass out to measure the vodka. Oh no, oops, did I forget to measure the vodka? It's probably a lot, but we're here now. We have pineapple juice. Glug, 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 glug. And orange juice. This orange juice and sucks, by the way. It's like sweet and gross, and it's also the only one the gas station had. Not even that strong. We did good, all right. Let's get to pretzeling. Okay, you need one and a half cups of warm water. Then you need one tablespoon of sugar, which preferably if you have actual tablespoons, use that because one tablespoon is not really one tablespoon. You know what? We're gonna actually try, okay? We're gonna follow directions. Have this scale, we can do this. How much is one tablespoon in grams? It's 0.0039 gallons. Okay, well, that's not helpful. How much is one tablespoon in ounces? The answer is 0.5 fluid ounces. Okay, thank you. Much better. Love is good. Oh, what? Oh, 0 0.50, right? That's what it said, right? I hope that's what it said. Ooh, 46, okay. <gasps> We're over. Oh no, what are we gonna do? We're still gonna use warm water, even if you're using instant yeast. The only difference is, normally, if you're using active yeast, you would use an entire packet of these. Um, they say use 25% less uh, <laughs> if you're using this, so I assume that just means you're gonna use one, huh? it's one fourth ounces. Never mind. I'm not doing this. I'm so bad at math and it's just gonna be embarrassing. I'll figure it out off camera. I know it's hella easy and I'm already stupid. It says to add the salt in here with normal yeast, which I don't recommend. You should have your yeast sit and kind of rise up for a while because salt actually eats away at yeast while sugar helps feed it. So do your sugar and yeast first. These people are whack, they're dumb. 
Not real bakers. Not real bakers. What is two teaspoons in ounces? The answer is 0.33 fluid ounces. Ugh. Okay, that's unfortunate because nothing happened. Okay, well I'm just gonna stop because it's not adding it and that has to be two teaspoons. We're gonna basically just add our dry ingredients now. Four tablespoons is one stick, my dude. Damn, I am hyper, hyper. My only measuring cup cracked and I don't know why I only have one measuring cup that came with my like cheese grater by the way. Oh, my life's in shambles. Oh shit, the butter. God, I'm so forgetful. Well, it's definitely melted. <laughs> Three, four, and a half. I always forget that baking is more difficult because it's technically like an exact Science, blah, 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 everyone wants to always say, thank you, it's a science. And I don't like to live my life with rules. Uh, just cooking. I actually have a lot of rules I have to follow, but <laughs> wish I didn't. All right, and then now we gotta figure out how much. Uh, so if this is, I'm just gonna do two teaspoons and we'll call it a day. And then you're just gonna start making a dough out of this. Very fun. personally hand knead it because it tastes better, tastes more authentic. I'm lying, I hand knead it because I don't have a stand mixer. And when you do shit like this, you sure wish you had a stand mixer. Oh, I put my hair up, but I think I just saw a hair somewhere and I will flip out. I will, don't test me, I hate hair. Don't care if it's my own, it's disgusting and it makes me throw up. Did I, did I see a hair? Was I hallucinating? Oh God. Ugh, I don't know what to do now. About to just throw it all away. It wasn't in it, it was near it. Looking really closely, I don't see anything. It might have been my imagination because I often, because I fucking hate hair. Was it in here? Where did I see it? Ugh, my hair has to be blonde too. Well, let's just move on and hope for the best.
Oh my God. What is happening? Not using that cup. So much flour, butter, like everything terrible that could be on a camera. It's a good angle. <laughs> so cool. All right. Good mama.